What up, what up, what up? Quick video here, details. This is on GSO with a few people that you see play the other maps, but a handful of randoms too, so this is not super entertaining or exciting as far as a bunch of pros go. But this is going to give you my take and ideas on this map. So I know below me is G unit, so he knows what he's doing. Above me, I'm not sure who that is. And then Blue wasn't so sure. So I knew my, my bottom teammate was good. The other one's not so sure. So I'm going to be more worried about helping out and protecting the top guys. What I did early was send a scout to make sure I anti scout. He sent a scout around the map here trying to get some. Scouting in. What you want to do on this map is you want to go tons of infantry, and then when it looks like you're winning the infantry battle or you've got things neutralized, then you want to go tons of titans. So economy and titans, and uh, usually EMP. You could tech up, but it's such a small map, and when people are teching up too early, you're gonna see the errors. So Gold sent his infantry too early. I helped out to kill those. That's a mistake. Good to be aggressive, but you don't want to be aggressive when you're uh, matched. So what I'm doing here is just building up. I'm going to sell my second refinery, make sure my harvester is getting the blue tip. And then I'll have enough infantry to be shooting disc throwers and using the light infantry. So you see me doing most of that. And now the right side should be doing the exact same thing. They should be seeing how much inf we have. They should be countering with the same amount. The GDI guys should be doing disc throwers towards us, but they're not, so they're so far behind right now, which is not good for them. It you know, allows us to get ahead with economy, kills, pressure, have the tempo, which is most important. So I'm just keeping my, my top units here to guard my discman and help out my teammate. Use the blue ones, the blue discman to you know, pick off kills or draw infantry in. So now I'm going to lose my infantry because green came, but red still got a bunch. And, you know, you can get away because of blue tip. You can get away with three refing on this map if you want, maybe. But you usually four refs, sometimes even five refs, because you want to win the game. You want to scout. You want to have pressure. And if you don't do that, if you go early tech, usually the good players across from you are pumping more infantry and or, you know, titans, and then you're not going to be able to do anything with your tech units or even get there. So you see, we're, we're winning the inf battle, all of us, so either we're better players or they made some mistakes. And I'm building up some more power just because... You know, I'm going to go for EMP. Now, what I did here in the beginning is I put my power plant towards the back, so the G unit, and my barracks out front. Why? Because we know they're going to be pushing infantry towards us. So why put a power plant, something so important, out in front where it gets killed, you get totally slowed down. Plus, you want your refineries real close to the, the Tiberium. So, power plant in the back in the beginning, barracks out front, because you want your men pumping out there fast. And what did I do here? Okay, I sold my radar too soon. That's an error. Don't do that. I don't have a, a war factory, so don't copy that. But what I was doing was making sure I'm getting an EMP really fast. I saw G unit going Titans, so I want to get an EMP while he's has Titans built up, and then I'm going to build some Titans with him. I'm still building the infantry. Why? I got a lot of money. They're bringing infantry at us, and we can keep putting pressure on them. So green... On the other side, he's doing pretty good. He's waiting back. He's making sure he has more men. He's using a harpy now. He's picking off disc throwers. So as far as the infantry goes, um, it seems like he's playing pretty smart. I forget some of his earlier stuff. Purple has a ton of disc men. He needs to spread them out. He has a medic with him, which is interesting. Or it looked like he did. Yeah, he does in the back. But he needs to spread them out, especially with a harpy out there. And he needs to be throwing them at units. See, he should not be engaging here. That's just a bad idea. All right, I got my war factor here. I guess I wasn't really planning on teching up, so selling the radar early wasn't that big of a mistake, but if I was planning on teching, it would be. What I'm gonna do here is just build more EMP, build up a bunch of Titans, and EMP somebody across and go attack them. 
left side, they're winning the imp battle, they have better economy, they're keeping the pressure on the right side on, on all spots, so they're way ahead. So the right side needed better economy early on, they needed to control the infantry better, and like this gold player has his war factory out close, when he's losing, maybe not the best of idea. Control your hearts, get blue table whenever you can, especially if you don't have a ton of money in the bank. So my EMP is ready. I'm gonna build out closer to them, probably EMP them. Just throwing the pad. Just in case, no, oh yeah, I thought I was gonna build a pad just in case and also use that to expand out, but. Alright, see Red moving forward. He needs to make sure he has more units than the other team. He doesn't, so he should pull back even further. And now I'm an EMP, now they're GG. So I don't think we, I was scouted, so it looks like pink and green were gonna try and double team Red. Not, not a bad idea at all, um, but you know, EMP is what, you should have here on this map. So economy, EMP, Titans, and Imp, that's really the name of this game. Um, if you're protected by some good players, maybe tech up if you want to, but such a small map, I don't think you ever really need to. I don't know what Orange is doing all game, he has no Titans, he's just infantry only, and he's not doing a very good job with them. Blue has this wall of components up there, so infantry are definitely not going to do much against that. And then purple is going to bomb those, so orange. Orange had the idea, let's go economy and tons of infantry to keep pressure good, but he's got to get titans and other things going on two minutes ago, three minutes ago like we did. And now blue's going to take him out. Purple's coming. I'm going to have another EMP here, so it's, it's a good game. Looks like Green was the only person on that side that had a clue. He was building a lot of M. He did good economy. He's got those um, tanks there deployed. The top players and the very bottom players on here should do what Red's doing, what Green's doing right now, is build your refs below you and get the blue tip there. That way your teammates can get the other blue tip. I think G-Unit builds his refs going to the far back in the beginning, which I think is a mistake. Maybe it's smart in the very beginning just to be safer, but it starts taking blue tip from your teammates. What do you guys think? In the beginning, should the top spots build, the top bottom spots build the refiner straight up, straight down and get that tip first? Or should they start in the back a little safer and then go towards those spots? Uh, let me know in the comments. I'm interested to see what you guys know. And that's it, guys. All right. Go kill it on GSO. And let me know your thoughts there on where to put the refs in the beginning. Catch you on the next one.